I'd like to say a few words In defense of our liberals Our liberals ain't bad, no are they mean The liberal leaders they have While they are pretty bad Hardly the worst this poor world has seen Let's turn history's pages, shall we? Take Mao, for example. Why, within the first few years of him, he'd criminalize free speech, rule from the side of his forbidden city swimming pool, and preside over the executions of millions of people. A few years later, he outlawed private food production, and millions more died. That's like single-payer agriculture or something. It's not a very good example right now, is it? But here's one. The Eastern European Soviet occupation put people in a terrible position. I don't even like to think about it. Well, sometimes I like to think about it. Just a few words in defense of our liberals whose time at the top could be coming to an end. Now we don't want their love and respect for their views is out of the question. But in times like these we sure could use a friend. Hitler, Stalin, liberals who need no introduction. Fidel Castro, that's right, liberals think he's so great. Well, he took control of Cuba, jailed and killed thousands of people just for speaking their mind or being suspected of having one. But hey, man, now Cubans are all equal and desperate. A president once said, a man has property in his opinions. Now you're required to agree to give your property to someone else. It's patriotic, in fact, and compassionate. And if you don't play along, there's a government man with the guns. That's what the Second Amendment is for, isn't it? It's what it used to be for. The end of socialism is messy at best. And this plunderous state is ending Like all the rest Like French automobiles Engulfed in the streets We're engulfed in the land of the brave And the home of the free Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye